Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are watching, you have come to Enigma 77 Reviews. My name is Rachel and today we are going to do some lovely shoe reviews on another one of my favourite brands. How did we guess? Yeah, so guys, I am really fussy when it comes to um, as what I'd call flat-footed shoes. I have experimented in all kinds of trainers and I like to keep to um, certain brands like Converse and DCs and I've, I've kind of gone for skater shoes in the past. In fact, I've had quite a lot of skater shoes. I've gone through my grungy days and um, I still like my Converse. Due to me having like a back disability, my alternative footwear actually works better for me and my back rather than your everyday shoes. So I took a chance in these um, because I'm not very good with white. Hmm, figure that. But I got these because I thought they was really quirky. Now I've had loads of the um, of these kind of converse that are quite kind of flat footed i do have a black pearl like that I'm not overly keen on how they look on your feet um and i i find they're really hard to get on because one they're laced up and you've kind of got a struggle getting your foot in the damn thing and then pulling it up at the back for for everybody else that's probably really easy and something they don't even think about but for me i find it an absolute struggle um, I just prefer to get my shoes on just by slipping them on. Now I have recently got some pink Converse. Absolutely love them. Pink, I know. The only problem I'm finding is they're pink, they're light pink, and they get dirty so quick. So when I got these, I don't know what I was thinking, but I've gone for it anyway. So let's get on with it. So the box is pretty much the same kind of box that all comes for the Converse. And I keep my boxes, guys. I've always, always have kept my boxes. And I have sold shoes in the past and I've always found it's easier to sell when you've got the box. But we're not gonna sell these, guys. We've only just got them. So when you open the box, it comes with a return form and um, just tells you, or, well, mainly asks you, what's wrong with the trainers and why they're faulty um, and then it just gives you return instructions it's pretty explanatory and common sense will tell you that anyway so they are wrapped up with with tissue paper and oh boy when i first opened these i don't know what i was expecting i don't think i was expecting them to to kind of look so crazy on the sole of the shoe but i like um, I, I really do like shoes that have got good grips because I have slipped many times in shoes. It's not really a good look when you fall flat on your ass and it's not a good look when you fall flat on your face either. And I've, I've done this twice now on numerous occasions and I've hurt my knees, which are crap anyway, and my back. So this is a little bit of reason why I go for this kind of shoe. Let's get out there quick. So guys, this is what I bought crazy looking shoes aren't they and if you look guys i haven't worn these by the way i have tried them on today and that's about it um they are crazy the grips on these are immense i probably could go skating on ice in these and i'd still have pretty good grips and yes i know they're white but the reason i like these kind and not the other kind is one the other kind of kind of really um there's no bulk in them if you know what i mean i kind of like these kind of shoes because they're quite the platform's quite big and i like kind of platform shoes no matter what they are yes they're white and the reason i got white because they only did these in white and black and i've already got a black pair of converse why would i buy another pair which is pretty much the same apart from the the back the the bottom of the sole so they come with a little symbol which is here and it's got a, a lovely like a luminous orange stripe going right through it which is a bit funky and they're like a like a peachy pink color inside and i've tried these on today guys and i'm not joking you 
it's like walking on air they feel so comfy and my pink ones that i got they're the same they're really comfy but when i put my other ones my black ones i will do a review on them at some point so you can get to see what these black ones are they are horrid they're like walking on on pavement it's they're just not comfortable i put these on today and yes i struggled a little bit getting them on because they are the same type of trainer boot thing um but once i had them on my feet and i had them tied up i thought oh wow these are really really fab now let's get on to a little bit of information on these um let's have a look so these were bought on ebay guys this item is now out of stock so where i got them particularly i mean i was trying to find the the most cheapest pair i could find um so where i got them from is actually sold out but they do still do these in other places so they're not like retired or anything you can still buy these from other places it's just comparing your prices guys because some of these are at the top end some of these are like 83 pound and they that's exactly the same as these but like the army khaki ones i really wanted them the camouflage really really wanted them i'll try and get the picture up so you can see but 83 pounds a bit steep just to have a different different color so anyway so as you can see from the picture guys there is the black the only thing that put me off as well the fact that the black is they had a massive white platform sole and i just think it looks a bit silly as the white you're not going to tell so these are converse seaters lift ripple high textile high top sneakers they're women's by the way not men's they were 68 pound 50 it was free postage um obviously the color is just black and white but they are literally sold out on this site so bug me they sold they must be the cheapest pair that i found to be honest with you guys um let's have a look if it says anything else about it i hate it when they don't give you much information about it i always think well where's the rest of the information hello i need to know more i know that when when these were ordered they did give us more information here we are here we are so sole is rubber lace up high top trainer boots built to stand out the chuck taylor all style lift ripple high trainers from converse offer a look that screams tough but glam okay perfectly matching any look and oozing confidence these high top flat form sneakers are a great addition to your casual shoe collection i have that too classic canvas with tonal double stitching low on the toe traditional lacing system for a personalized fit aluminium eyelets for a classic look so this is pretty much telling you everything about the boot the shoe high profile construction to keep ankles secure now guys while I, i'm on that subject of ankles i do have issues with my um right ankle as well so for me comfort is key and I have crockled a fair few times in certain footwear, demonias being one. Um, and I just think now at the age that I am, I've got to think about my disability and comfort and everything else. So you can't go around buying a nine pound pair of shoes that have got no support, if you know what I mean, for someone like me. So um, moisture wicking and breathable textile lining for dry and healthy in shoe climate for in other words if you've got smelly feet um and that's pretty much it guys um i can't see anything else about it if you do click onto it it will tell you in more detail every single thing you want to know size guide but we're not going to go into that um so guys there's got the little symbol at the back you need to let me know what you think of these because i'm kind of growing on them when i first initially saw them i just thought mm. talking of which guys let me just see if i can let me see if i can get the ones that i actually wanted because i really did want these i just couldn't justify an extra 20 pound i just didn't understand an extra 20 pound for something that's the same bloody thing it's just different color come on sorry guys my phone is so slow today so these are exactly the same name 
Oh. I sometimes wonder if paying that extra bit would have been worth it. Oh, guys. These are beautiful. They've actually got, like, cherry blossom. And they're in grey. Let me just zoom in. So, if you have a look. Look at them. They're so pretty. Oh. Do you think I could send them back and, and get them ones? Seriously? On a serious level, no. I, I don't I don't believe in paying extra £20 for a few flowers being on my shoe. I'll paint them on my bloody self if I had to. So guys, that is them. Um if you like these shoes and you really you really want to know how they are on. I, I mean, I will try them on for you at the end. So make sure you, you watch that. And just let me know what you think there and then. Loved you out of the blue. Now that I see it's you. Your loving was overdue. Now all that I see is you So if you like what you see, pop a comment down below. It'd be interesting to see if these shoes are what you may call ugly or you think these shoes are good value for money. I mean, I've had Converse that have been really expensive in the past. I mean, when they, they first started coming out and they were so popular, I've paid crazy prices just for my kids to have Converse shoes. You know, it's some fans and... At the age of 42, you're probably thinking, why are you wearing Converse? But why are you not wearing hush puppies? No, guys. I might be 42, but this girl needs her comfort. So, guys, if you want to see what these look like, I will be modelling them in a bit. And um, don't forget to subscribe, like and share. It's really good to get a lot of these people coming in now. Um, and I really appreciate all the support guys it does mean a hell of a lot to me so that's it for today guys short and sweet but let's see how these babies um, work let's let's wear them in and see maybe I'll come back in a week or so and tell you about all the converse that I've been wearing and maybe we'll do a competition on which one's best I don't know. I'm just trying to think of all kinds of ideas. Okay, guys, so that's it for today. If you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, and like and share. Don't forget to put your comments on. Until the next one, I'll see you then. Bye for now. Bye.